Just got a call that the people that are delivering our new Valencia seats are on the way, which means we're now officially saying goodbye to the seat craft chairs that you've all come to know and love. And my family is also in town the day that they're delivering this, so I'm doing this in front of my sister, which feels very awkward. Do I talk like I'm a news anchor? Yes, I do. My name is Holden Hardman. <laughs> So I'm gonna probably have to move the car out of the garage because I listed these bad boys on Craigslist in the Facebook Marketplace, but I have nowhere to put them for the time being. So that's gonna be thing number one. Oh, look, AJ. Oh, no, that's Fox, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so is that we've had these chairs since we were in the old, old apartment a long while back. trying to figure if it's better for me to take the chairs out through this tiny door here or if I should take them out the front and then around to the garage out the front I think that door is bigger what do you think AJ so if you post me should I take it out the front it'll be the death of you say front or back back <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go out the front though <laughs> Peter if you get this door for me <laughs> Buff out those scratches. <laughs> You're just so weird. Right, my face. <laughs> the last chair moving away. <laughs> On to bigger and better things. A lot of people didn't know we had the sound shaker installed on those chairs. So in accordance with the action on the screen, the chairs would like vibrate. So I got to uninstall that now. Look at the difference in our carpet. Clean where the dogs are. really excited to check out the new Valencia seats. Thank you Valencia so much for supporting us and supplying these chairs for us. I can't wait to check them out. I'm sure they'll be absolutely fantastic. Quit looking at me like that, Adrian. This is how I feed my family. <laughs> <laughs>
very, very comfortable chairs when we're doing that. There have been a few times when we were in the seat craft chairs and I had to get up for something and I'd go ahead and lift the legs up or put the legs down and they're just significantly slower than the Valencia chairs. Uh, it seems like all the power in the side that adjusts the headrest, the lumbar, and the legs just have a little bit more oomph in the Valencia chairs. Even something as simple as the LEDs in the chairs themselves. In the Seacraft, you had one option. They're either on or off in that blue light. And while we liked them, we really didn't use them a whole lot, as is evidence in the videos that we've done. Partly because when we would use them, because they would shine on the sides, they would basically illuminate the screen a little bit and also illuminate the walls some. In these, not only can we choose between different colors, but they're a little bit more subtle. In the seat craft, they would turn off after about an hour, so even when we would have them on, they would shut off by themselves and we'd have to turn them back on anyways. These lights stay on. They're also lit down at the base, so it's not shining up back at the screen. And of course, the cup holders light up too. And I can change them to any color that I want. Another great feature of these chairs in comparison to the Seatcraft is that the Seatcraft had a USB charging port, which I would use sometimes to charge my phone while we're watching a movie, but it would only ever slow charge. And I would ch sometimes change out the cables thinking it may have been a cable problem, but I think it was just a power source problem. On here, not only does it have a USB charger, it also has a USB-C charger, which does fast charge my Samsung. My favorite feature of the chairs is a memory lock of your favorite chair position. So if I wanna recline, I wanna have the head head up a little bit. I'm adjusting the headrest. So if this is the position I prefer, say I wanna be inclined even more, all I have to do is hold down this button and it memorizes it. So I'm done watching my movie. I wanna put the chair back down the way it was. Once I get the chair back to its normal position, I wanna watch the movie again. I love my, I, I love my position. I press the button and it will automatically go to my preferred position. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. So the Seacraft chair was great, but it only inclined to about this far, I'd say. It's about at the extent uh, of the angle you could get. On the Valencia baby, I can just keep going back. Oh. So this is perfect for napping. This is way like significantly further than the Seacraft chair would go. There are other small things about it too that I really prefer. For one, I don't have all the cables behind the chair that are just uh, going crazy. They always give me some anxiety like they're gonna catch fire when I had the Seacraft chairs. On here, it's very simple. They're just like plugged straight into the wall. As you've already seen, I had to assemble the chairs myself. They were not very difficult, but they were a little time consuming. When we got the Seacraft, we opted in for what's called a white glove delivery where the people that deliver it just assemble it for us. So we did not opt in for that when we got the Valencia, but assembling them wasn't too bad. It was just, it was a little tedious, but you can still opt in to have the white glove delivery so that somebody will assemble them for you if you prefer. When we got Seacraft, we really regretted not having a love seat in the middle. Uh, in some of the old videos that Jen and I would make, uh, we would always kind of be cuddled up. And when we had the seat craft chairs, we really couldn't do that anymore because they were divided like these two. Uh, so I did ask if, when they sent us the chairs, if we could have a love seat in the middle so that Jen and I could go back to our snuggling ways, uh, especially since we're having a baby on the way, so we like to be close together. Uh, and they, they were very nice and <laughs> agreed to do that. So I love that. This is another small thing, but it makes a really big difference because in the Seacraft chairs, they were not actually locked in place together. They were just sort of scooted in place. These ones actually will lock. So I can't move them apart with any type of uh, ease. They're locked in, so it's really hard for the chairs to kind of get disordered, disorganized. On the Seacraft ones, I was kind of, it wasn't a big deal, but it was just one of those small things where I would kind of occasionally, periodically have to realign the chairs to make sure that they were all um, together. Not a big deal, but it's nice to have them interlocking so they don't have to do that anymore. Each of the Seacraft chairs has uh, these options here. One adjusts the uh, recline, one adjusts the lumbar, and one adjusts the headrest. H here controls the light, so I can make the lights any color I want. I can have them flicker, whatever I want. Here is the memory. So if there's a particular way I like my seats, like I like my headrest, my lumbar, and my recline, I just hold it in and it will memorize it. Another feature I really like, and again, it's a small thing, but it does make a difference. Uh, the Seacraft armrests were also like storage, had storage in them. These will actually like remain up. So there's some give. So you lift it up a little bit and it'll go ahead and go up. The other ones didn't really have that. It was kind of like once you got it up, it would stay, but you put it there and it would drop down. So overall, I'm very happy to say that I do think the Valencia chairs are not only better, I do think that they are significantly better. I think that there's just more craftsmanship overall 
in the quality of the chairs and the leather of the chairs. So I'm very happy to say that we do not regret getting these. We do think that they are better. We are going to be keeping them and we're trying to get rid of the seat craft uh, because we have most significantly upgraded. If you've been following the channel for any length of time, you know that Jen and I had to move twice in the past year and it was a big headache. We hated it. Uh, it was a whole ordeal. During one of those moves, one of the wires under one of the Seatcraft chairs got bent by one of the movers. And I tried going online to basically just replace that wire. I looked, I looked up what the problem was. I could fix it myself if I just had the cable, I could just switch it out, not a big deal. And I reached out to their customer service and uh, basically said, hey, I, I, I can't find this cable anywhere online. Can somebody help me? Never got a response. I messaged them again uh, a little bit later, about a week or two later, never got a response. So even at the end, I never got that replaced because I never got a hold of their customer service. Valencia, upon making the order, I had the chairs within one week. Real quick, when we ordered Seatcraft, it took about three months. We ordered our like new movie style couches, but it was delayed and we had already arranged for our old couch to be donated. And obviously we're not gonna be schmucks and be like, sorry, you can't have the couch. We went ahead and got rid of our old couch. So we are temporarily in limbo as far as the couch goes, but it's fine. So I don't know if that's going to be your experience, but just saying, when you're ordering between Valencia, it seems at least that they had chairs in stock and were able to ship them out relatively quickly. Whereas Seatcraft, not as fast. So thank you Valencia for sending us these chairs. Uh, I cannot wait to uh, feature them and show them off in some of the future videos and hopefully some of my audience members if they were thinking about getting some high quality like the highest end movie theater seats uh, hopefully you guys will consider Valencia make sure you click the link in the description below if you'd like to check these out maybe they're for you you can get them in various styles this obviously isn't the only style you can customize them like if you wanted your love seat there instead of in the middle like we have it you could do that so we love them thank you guys so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next video take care